What is up, YouTube? It's your girl, Rochelle. I'm back with another video. Thank you guys for tuning in. I am back with a paycheck budget for week three slash week four of September 2023. I don't know which week it is, y'all. We just rolling with it. I am back for a paycheck budget and cash stuffing video. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thanks for showing me so much love since your girl returned to the tube. I am feeling it. I am. Don't worry. I have my watch list. It is so full. I can't wait to catch up on content and tune into you guys' channels. Drop a comment below if you plan on on dropping a video this sometime this week um, so I can check it out. All right, but for now, let's dive right in. Um, I have my total income for, let me zoom y'all in. Let me zoom you, let me zoom you. I could do this. You know what, I'm gonna leave it alone and do it on the edit side. Um, a total income of $7,681.87. Okay, so um, I thought it was gonna be $43.95, but it ended up being $76.81.87. I see what changed. First up, I thought Hubby's W-2 was going to be about $3,300. It was a little more. It was $3,347.86. Thank you. Next is Sister Locks. I thought I was going to bring in just over $1,000. I ended up bringing in $1,830.18. And then we had some rental property income totaling $2,503.83. Let's see how we spent it. First off, we sent $70 to savings. Such a weird number. I wonder why it was 70. Oh, sorry. Mama business, mama business. Um, because this is auto, auto savings. Remember, the goal is not to save, the goal is to pay off debt. Because I can't do these minimum payments for the rest of my life. I'm over it. Okay, so first up, the HELOC got a thousand. Our Amex got a thousand. Amazon got 397. My credit card got 278.56. Discover got 258. Our Apple credit cards got $171.38, and our Chase credit card got $70. So total $31.74.94. Don't forget, y'all, this is that this is not that casual spin. This is medical debt. This is life stuff going on, okay? <laughs> if you want to know, the HELOC update video is coming. It's coming probably later this week because I'm going to film it tomorrow morning because I have so much to say. So much to say. Okay, anyway, Buffer ended up getting $18.83 and 10 cents um, instead of the $41.95 that I projected because I ended up sending most of it to debt. Then we had the rental property. We had an invoice to pay for the month of September, totaling $1,107.80. If you have not tuned into my October 2023 budget with me video, I talk more on the rental property situation. Um, and just like not like how it's going, just overall, like to rent or to buy. I just feel like it doesn't really matter. <laughs> it doesn't. Because at the end of the day, you need somewhere to lay your head. Um, and of course, if we were still living in our paid off home, that would be ideal. But also we wanted to try living somewhere else. And I'm so grateful that we have, for the most part, always had a tenant, um, which always helped to, you know, mine our pockets, bring in some income to help offset some of the maintenance costs. Because even if the house is empty, <laughs> you're still going to spend money, okay? You're still going to spend money on the house. Anyway, the rental property invoice from the property manager totaled that. And then I wanted to go ahead and set aside $396.03 for some upcoming bills, lawn maintenance, property manager for next month, and the credit card. That totaled $1,503.83. Next off, Micah got his usual $200, and we got $850 to cash spend. And I gave Eva and Micah most of this. And I hope you check out some of their content because I'm going to post their videos separately because, y'all, we a cash stuffing family now out here. We out here. Micah is a cash stuffer. He got his own envelopes, his own binder, and so does Eva. You know, Eva always had her own. But now I'm like, let me let them be great. Let me let them, let me let them do it, Okay. But anyway, that is how we budgeted. Now let's cash stuff my envelopes. So first up, first things first, let's see how much I have left to stuff. We're going to be stuffing our central sinking funds, our essential categories for our family, and maybe like one savings challenge. And we'll check on our wallet envelopes, which still has the same money from last week. I just want to just double check because I don't think I've done any spending out of my wallet. But 100, 200, 300, 400, 450, 470, 490, 510, 530, 550, 
I thought I gave them more than that, but I forgot I had extra money that I um, wanted to give Micah that I had kind of set to the side. So yeah, he did his own cash off video. It was hilarious. Check it out. Okay. So first up, let's look at the wallet. <coughs> Cause I want to see what your girl got left. Okay, so food, it has 20. You know, we're gonna add a 50 to that. Cause <laughs> $70. So that $1,000 a month, this is part of that. That um, I talk about, like, we, we end up spending $1,000 in food. That includes the $50 a week that I use for cash spending. Shopping is empty. Okay, we can add a 20 to that. Let's see. Tips. It has the same $20. That's good. Beauty has 20. Row has 20. Miscellaneous got a little more. It's got 40. Ooh, okay, okay. We have some receipts. Yes, ma'am. So I will scan that into the Fetch app. And nothing in bank. Now, I already took out the change. Where is it? I put it in a separate little thing. That's so unorganized. Get your life together, Rochelle. Get your life together, girl. Okay. Found the change that I had already taken out of my wallet and then lost that quickly. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay gonna be a big contribution this week y'all to our keep the change savings challenge okay so we got a dollar fifty a dollar sixty five a dollar seventy all right Let's see, this is the right one it is not i really gotta start keeping this stuff together okay here we go so, $1.70, y'all. $1.70. Let's see if that equals $5 yet. I don't think so, but you never know. Ever since that check mark. 2.13 plus 0.94 plus 0.13 plus 1.7 is... <laughs> Four dollars and ninety cent. Cruel. It's a cruel world. It's okay. Okay, the other savings challenge that you know we are focused on, and I'm so proud of us for even be able be for even being able to do a savings challenge, um, despite the fact that we did not have our usual income this month. This month, we're still killing it. We are going to continue in our still summer September challenge. Let's see. Let's do another twenty dollars. So that means we can fill in the flip-flops. And we can fill in the shades. That's what I'm talking about. Only doing half because I have to still record for the other short form content. That's the thing I'm like, how can I just get this content to be content for everywhere? I don't want to keep doing stuff and filming stuff twice. That just seems like twice the time, don't it? I don't know. I need to give that to my social media manager and let him figure that out. August. Oh, wait. That's right. We skipped August because we was traveling. So September. 
see what we got so far. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 105, 110, 115, 120, y'all. I can dig it. I can dig it. Okay. Now let's do our essentials with whatever we got left. You know what? I do want to do a third saving challenge. I almost forgot. I really want to finish this. My 25 envelope saving challenge because this is an extra $300 that I could send to savings or to debt at the end of the year. And we got us a new fresh scratch off card. So we're gonna get as close as we can to $20. This is the $75 card. So these are all cards you can buy on my website. Let's see, of course this says 25, of course. Of course. It says to save $25. All of my 20s are full. We did that. Look at that, all those are full. We must really be getting down to the wire. You know what, let me find my check off. Okay, I found my check off. See, I still wanna check off. I wanna complete two more scratch offs and I think that'll equal all this money. Ah, oh, this still isn't. Okay, I found it for real this time. So 22 and 23 are taken, are not taken rather. So there are some 20s left. So what I'm going to do is take the biggest one to 23. I'm going to add $20. And I will just kind of do an IOU and owe myself five. This really works. Like, I can't believe I saved this much money. This tracker is helping me. Okay, so I'll say, oh, five. Because I scratched off five. I really want to do more when I can. Okay. I spent 25 on the little. Now, now we can do the essentials. We still have a good amount left. We have at least $460 left. And that is for good reason. I'm going to work out of order here. Because in my head, I need to stuff certain categories. So first up is Tess. We're giving Tess 100. So Tess now has 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 750, 70, 90, 810, 30, 50, 70, 90, 9, $10, $920. Remember, when it gets to a thousand, we get to stuff it in a bank. Okay, the other thing I really want to add money to is our phone bill. It's going to be time to pay my phone bill next month. Um, so for the year, so I'm adding a hundred, and now has 100. Got to put it in order 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 20, 40, 60, 80, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800, 820, 840, 850, 865. Not bad, not bad. Okay, now, now we can focus on some other stuff. Um, gifts, yes, I'm going to give another 20. So it now has 100, 200, 300, 320, 340, 360, 380, $410. Health, I'm going to actually give 100. I'm trying to pay off um, a medical bill and it's on my credit card right now getting extra payments, but I really want to get as close as possible to knocking it out. Um, so it now has 100, 200, 250, 270, 290, 310, 330, 350, 370, 390, 410, 430. I think when it gets to five, I'm going to pull all this out and that would, that would help to cover an urgent care 
visit we had in Mexico for Eva. I think that bill came to 500. Yeah. Yep. But y'all, when I tell you we got such good medical care in <laughs> Mexico. Oh. So hard not to talk about that stuff. It was so much better than here. Okay, so house and hygiene is getting its usual 20. It now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120. We're pretty stocked up for the house right now, so I'm letting this build up. Next month we'll be set. Okay, what else do I really care about? Self-care is empty. We sent Micah for his massage and stuff. Okay, I'm giving us $100. We're setting it right back up. Okay, $100 for self-care. Doing all the things, all the things. Okay, gifts. We'll give gifts $20. It now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 110, 115, 120. And we'll give beauty 20. So it now has 40. Let's see, what else haven't we done other than myself? We'll give 20. The last 20 to tech, it now has 40. All right, guys, that is it for our cash stuffing and our budget for this week's video. I'll see y'all in the next one. Until then, you know what it is. Peace, love, and budgets.